All right, so we're looking at using your compass to draw several concentric circles that have point A as a center, and then draw those same sized concentric circles that have B as a center. So we have point A right here, and point B right here. Concentric circles means the center for A So if I was to copy the circle, oops, go back, and have the center be B, and then I drew another circle from A. These two circles are concentric because the center is A and the center is still A. If I duplicate it, and I make the center for this one B, could do another one. So let's say from A, should we go a little bigger? Sure, let's just go a little bigger. And if I duplicate this one, I have two sets of concentric circles. One set is around set A, and we'll make those red. Those three are concentric. And another set around B, and those three are concentric. So we have two sets of concentric circles on the same size. What do you notice about where all the circles with center A intersect and all the corresponding circles with center B intersect? So if you look, they intersect here, 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 here. They all intersect at the same line. If I connect all the points, they're exactly the same. So in the problem above, you have demonstrated one way um, the, to find the midpoint of a line segment. So right here where they intersect is the halfway point between A and B. So that is the video for 7.1, the ready.